Hello and welcome back to Mine Time. We are now, um, I'm back up playing with the server. I got a bunch of new texture packs and all kinds of stuff. And today, whoa. Okay. Um, well, uh, uh, oh, look, there's water over here. No, look, there's water. <laughs> okay. Um uh you know I'm just gonna spawn us some water. Dash can I think I believe it's two? No. Eleven? Okay, no that's lava. Uh let's do away from there. Uh, get rid of that. No. There we go. Okay, but, um, come on, I got the water, but, um, this is a custom map, I can't remember who it's made by, uh, I'll figure that out later, I'll put a link in the description, um, two things, one, me and my sister switched our texture packs, uh, this is Gary Doku. Um, uh, we also switched our skins. I, I like to call my guy a question knight. Uh, two question marks on the front and back. I modified a rip doom in a box. But this is basically a big maze type thing. Ha ha ha, I knew there was a chest down here. But, whoa. Loot. But it's a basically a really difficult big maze where what you're supposed to do is go and um, find the four pieces of redstone that are somewhere around the maze. Link this up and flick the lever. We cannot cheat. We cannot break glass. But you know we had to get down here somewhat. Some way we cannot break sand, and um, we cannot leave the maze. So. Uh, those are our objectives. Let's see here. We are stuck with limited resources. All we got here is a tree and the loot I found in the box. And um, you're supposed to survive and do all those other things. This is the hardcore mode section. I don't know what that means. I'm guessing it just means there's gonna be monster spawners. No. Where do you get the melon? Where do you get the melon? There's four. Okay, here, let's see. Rules: no breaking the bedrock. Can't. No breaking the sand. Okay. No breaking glass. Well, we broke that, but you know. Go get the four pieces of redstone in each section of the maze. Yeah. Feel free to mine and craft the maze. Might get hard. Free food behind you. Oh, sweet. A uh hoe. What is that? Meat things and plants. That's good. So it's been a while since I've been playing with my sister, but I felt like we probably should continue working together on things like this. So, uh, I found this. Uh, um. Yeah, I don't know which way. I'm sure there's something. Wow, double flint. Amazing. This is the 1.1 Gerudoku 32x32 texture pack. Um, it's apparently been modified to be more realistic than it used to be. It actually used to look very, very... Yeah, there's an enchanting table and two chests. It ac Quit! It doesn't make the video funny. But we're right now stuck with limited supplies. Pumpkin seeds. Bucket. String torch shovel. Okay. Um 
first things first I believe would be to go and uh get some food craft some items and things and Kenzie's acting like she's taking a potty of course my God, Kenz. and apparently it's raining through the one hole Kenzie broke Jeez. <laughs> you're so ruining my video you know that right spring tree I still want to get tree punched or I don't know uh, wood punched leaf punched I don't know there but we now got a crafting table we need string for bed we can now make uh, re tools that's good don't go up the waterfall Okay. Well, this is the map. We're gonna do a little bit of work, collect some things, items, wood, so on and so forth. And then we'll start exploring. There's already creeper spawning. That's good news. Get down here. Torches. Okay. Sword? Food? Okay. Uh, I'll just take rotten flesh. No, I'll take these wheat. How many melons do we have? Give me the melon. Okay. There we go. Melon seeds. And we have spare bread. Okay. Let's go. Actually, I need a piece of the bread. Now let's go. Not go bathroom. Okay. Which one do you feel like going down? Ow. Which one do you feel like going down? This one turns. Let's just go down this one. Over here. Come on. This one. Turn around. Turn around. I'm over here. Just lower your settings. Oh god, this isn't gonna end well. I hear monsters. I see something. I think I see something. No, nope, it's nothing. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be forever. No, it's a good maze. This is very impressive. Just the scale of it. It's like a 250... I believe this is 256 by 256. Oh, God. I found a dead end. And another way. Here's Skelly. And a zombie. Why aren't there any mobs? I put it on hard difficulty. Oh, crud. I heard a cow. Oh, zombies. Ah, no. Don't let him get near you. They do a lot more damage than normal. Oh! <laughs> wow. No. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, a laggy creeper. No! He's glitching. Oh. Ah! He's glitching! There's a creeper, and he's like, glitching around the corner! I hate glitchies. Hi. Well, he just whacked you. This is a brutal death trap. How are we gonna find our way? I'm out of torches. I'm gonna head back. How are we gonna find our way out of this place? This is terrible. We could get lost in this place for ages on end. No, we can do. We have um, we have lots of dirt, and he said we can build, craft, and create anything we want because technically it's a survival map. And there is an enchanting table and two chests above our house, meaning we can just build our way up and just make a staircase. And why do I keep hearing a cow? This place is huge. To that funky uh, enchanting table. I don't have enough dirt. <sighs> well, there's one episode of our unsuccessful adventures on this. Alright then. Thank you for watching. Ha.